This will hurt. Activate skill. It's over. Nice. That went great. You're a true professional, then. Shut up. Take this. I'll fight you up! They're down! A champ! Activating drive. I won't let this chance slip by. Activating skill. You're open! Miss Alphayed. A boost would work here. Great! Breathe on to us! No, you won't! <laughs> there! Here goes! Activating Ooh. skill. Give me help! Boost gauge limit broken. Supervisor? Hey, everyone? Oh, pretty good. Please be okay. Okay. Shall I fetch a cold drink, Miss Alpha yet? There are a lot of enemies in this area. I hope everyone in the workshop will be all right. Take the sun! You snooze, you lose! With Ren calling the shots here, they this should be fine. Hurt. At least, Activate I'd like to think so. It's over! They're stunned! Activating skill! Nice! That went great! You're a true professional, then! Take this! Take this down! You snooze, you lose! This'll hurt! It's over! Up to you, Reset! A chance for a shot boost! Huh? A boost would work here. Blaze! Breathe on to us! A chance! Activating skill! Yeah! Yeah! No! Huh? Activating skill! <laughs> I can live with this. Shall I brew you some tea, Miss Clodagh? Gotcha. Now it's time to start. This will hurt. Get on your own. I'll dice you up. Get on your own. Up to you, reset. Now's our chance. Here's some extra. Perfect chance. Activating skill. Yeah. That one felt pretty Cypher activate! Get the upper hand! Activating drive! No you don't! <laughs> you won't get away with this! A boost would work here. You see Anna have a bus now! Here I go! A chance initiating drive! Miss Clodel!
eat this! Yeah. Huh? Up to you, Reset! Drive. This'll hurt. Give them your own. I'll dice you up. <laughs> Do your worst. A boost would work here. Activating skill. Yeah. Sucker. Reset. Activating drive. Engaging shield. I'm sorry, I know we're in a hurry, but can we stop by that house? That is Professor Hamilton's residence, correct? Launching ambush! Sure thing. We just gotta be quick about it. This'll hurt. Use the shark to get the upper Take hand. That. Take this! A chance! If you're going to boost, I do it now. Huh?
This'll hurt. It's over! All you on yet? If you're going to boost, I do it now. Huh? I won't hold back. Initiating drive. There. Activating skill. This'll hurt! I'll dice you up! All you on yet? If you're going to boost, I do it now. Activating drive. Blades. Initiating drive. Nice. Moving on up. Oh, I could do better. I did it! The arrow trams are inoperable. Use the bridge to cross into the artisanal district. Evacuate into the church for the time being. Bracers will be there in roughly 10 minutes.
Yeah. I'm on it. Show me what you're really capable of. Launching ambush. Use a shark boost and the upper hand. Then. Hit him fast, Barry. This will hurt. The boost would work. Activating skill. Here I go. Activating skill. Reset! A chance for a shot. Initiating drive. Activating drive. Activating yeah. skill! Ha! Yeah. The observatory nice. is on the left side that of the campus. Great. You can <laughs> fun, man! <laughs> Activating shark! Got it. Then we'll cut through the building and get there ASAP. There! A chance! Ah! Blaze! Breathe on to us! Payback time! I won't hold back! A chance for a shot boost! Huh? <laughs> there! Let's slow down! Here goes! Over here! All for you! Perfect chance! Yeah. No! Huh? Reset! I'm stronger than ever! This is crawling with mechanical nightmares! It's a good thing Yon got everyone out when he did. Bet we can rest there. Whew, that hits the spot.
the telescope's nowhere to be seen now. That's the main terminal, then? That's right. It's also known as the Aurora, and it's the pride of Basel. Professors Hamilton and Callahan led the charge in making it four years ago with the Institute, Vern, the Epstein Foundation, and ZCF support. But what program is it running? I can't make heads or tails of such complex code. Uh, look up there! The fifth Genesis. Figures we'd find it here. Along with... I suspected you would come, Arkwright Solutions. Oh, that we would meet again so soon after the film festival. It must be Adios's will bringing us together. The threads of fate bind us ever so strongly indeed. <laughs> Can't say I'm not a fan of that kind of thing. The monsters from the gardens who stole Ida from us! Oh, -ho -ho. you learned the name of my old home, did you? And I see that Marduk Concierge has officially joined your ranks. Professor Hamilton's favorite little one, too. Aren't we getting popular? <laughs> this kid's just with us as an advisor. So you're the ones who led Professor Callahan astray. What are you trying to do with the Aurora? You have no right to be using it! Oh, how misunderstood I am! I'll have you know that the Professor and I had quite a special connection. In fact, he gave us permission to use it. And since he was one of the developers, I think that does give us the right. This was very different from the relationship I had with President Dillon, by the way. It was more one of mutual benefit. Though I'll admit that certain inclinations of his did make my job a lot easier. A sensual whisper here, a little buttering up there, and he was more than ready to break every taboo I ever wanted. <gasps> How could you exploit someone so? It's not our place to judge what turns someone on. That stuff's personal. But you're still a piece of shit with a parking spot reserved in Gehenna. Right, and we'll be happy to give you a taste of the flames that await you right here. We're going to recover that Genesis and avenge those you've taken from this world. <laughs> Look at me, public enemy number one. Think you could lend me a shoulder to cry on, Olympia? You are only reaping what you sowed. Of course. The terms of my contract also do not allow me to simply give you all what you want. That angelic being we saw in Tharbad! Theo! Scanning material makeup. Unknown. High probability that the target is a form of artifact. Thought so. It's about the only thing that explains how it can fight like it does. There's more to it than meets the eye, too. Indeed. Take care, everyone. Your instincts serve you well. Incidentally, as I did not have the opportunity to introduce myself in Tharbad... I am Olympia, overseer of the Garden of Aram. This is Ishtanti. Our contract is with Almada at this time, so we remain focused on their needs. But should you require our services after that, we would be happy to oblige. What? You're asking if we want to hire an assassin? This some kind of joke? Or are you really out of your damn mind? Hmm? I was only trying to promote my services. It's true. She's not capable of joking, I'm afraid. As you can see, she's got work on the brain. Well, I think that's enough preamble. Been a good while, you know, since I tapped into my power as an overseer. <clears throat> They're auras! Of course they've been suppressing their power all this time. We'll need to use shards however we can to survive. Do whatever it takes to hold out. I can barely keep up with what's happening. 
But let's do this. Theo! Zeros! We can't allow these intruders to defile this sacred place a moment longer. Understood. I'll take you on. I'm Melchior of the Thorns. I'll be playing with you today. Olympia of Aurum, executing contract. Use a shark boost to get the end of the all! Over here! All for you! <laughs> Hit him fast, Barry. A boost would work here. You see Allah have our boss now! Yeah! Uh -huh. I won't hold back! A chance for a shard boost! Activating drive! Got a present for you! I won't lose! If you're going to boost, I do it now! Shields! Protect everyone! I got a whole slew of them! Brace yourself! Boost gauge, limit or unlocked! I hope you like this. Like hell you are! Heavenly Rondo. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Activating skill. <laughs> Here goes. Time for the... <laughs> oh, I get it now. So that is how it is. Boost gauge, limit or unlocked! <laughs> is everyone alright? But Malak is even more deadly than we thought. <sighs> Pisses me off. You haven't been taking us seriously all this time, have you? <laughs> oh, I showed Beauty's Blade a little of what I'm capable of. Just not you. Your strength is within my predicted parameters, including those Orbal Drones. As if that doll wasn't bad enough. Now we've got those bomb artifacts to deal with too. The Garden's Overseers are capable of even more than we feared it would seem. <sighs> if only I could make better use of Theo and Xeros' potential. <laughs> You're just so much fun to play with that you've got me all worked up. <laughs> I don't think I can resist the urge anymore. I know they've got the boss curious, Surely there's no harm in slicing them open while he's not looking. I am not your boss and will not speak for him. Do as you please. <laughs> Bring it, you son of a bitch! The flames of the Kruga have only just begun to burn! What? <clears throat> Decoding process complete. Executing emergence program. Where am I? I see. So it was a success. Uh, that sounds like... Well, would you look at that? It worked! So how does it feel, Professor? What's it like living in the digital world? It is even more comfortable than I had imagined. I'm frankly surprised by how comfortable it is. But I suppose it also makes complete logical sense. This is how it feels to be liberated of burdens and distractions. I can think more clearly than ever. The final stage of my work will be a breeze like this. Your expectations will be met. Oh, that's my big professor. You will be handsomely rewarded for your work. <sighs> A recording? No, wait. You are correct, young lady. This is no mere recording. I am the genuine David Callahan. 
professor of engineering science at the Basel Institute of Science, and a researcher whose name will go down in history. How the hell is this even possible? W we saw your body in the swamp! No way. Don't tell me. His knowledge, personality, and memories have all been converted into an AI. Most likely through the power of the Genesis. Also that he could surpass the limitations of the human mind and become a singularity. <sighs> Professor Callahan, how could... Well, well, you're even more perceptive than I expected. What a vexatious little maid you are. Must you be like this every time, Melchior? Our work here is done. We have no reason to stay any longer. Fine, fine. I suppose you're right. We'll see you later, Professor. Very good, then. I will be waiting for you. Warning! Explosives detected! That little bastard! <sighs> the Aurora! Zeros! Use your stun mode to stop- Uh-uh! No you don't! <sighs> no! Ah! Catra! You can't! Get back here! I won't let it happen. I won't let anyone damage the place she holds so dear! Shit! Damn it! What? <gasps> there it is! I thought something was off about you, but I never figured it ran that deep. I wonder if this is what came out of analyzing that other emperor and the rest of those types. I will need to revise my expectations of Marduk's capabilities. Ugh. And speak of the devil, I suppose it's time we made our exit then, hmm? As someone connected to another being, not a flesh, you have my respect. Till we meet again. No way. R Reset. This is... This is all my fault. You gonna be okay? 
Yes. I think so. I apologize for our sudden arrival during the frenzied events of yesterday. To start this off, I am General Manager of Marduk Total Security Company, Gilliam Thorndike. This is our Chief of Security, Qasem Al-Fayed. A pleasure to meet you all. I was not expecting you to travel all the way to Basel, but it is an honor to meet you all the same. I've heard many a rumor about how shrewd a manager you are, Mr. Thorndike. Together with your chief of security's combat exploits. You make me blush, your highness. I am humbled by your words. I arrived in my home country a few days ago, so I'm afraid I'm not up to date on all the latest developments. But am I to understand that Marduk will be responsible for securing the city of Basel for the remainder of the day? That is correct. Off the record, a presidential executive order was issued yesterday to that effect. A CID special ops unit will be arriving in the city this evening. Marduk's task will be to secure key facilities in Basel until they are ready. We've also brought one of the Ix-Alba series of airships that we're currently testing on behalf of the Republican Army. Said airship will allow us to ensure the integrity of the orbital network. Our goals on this particular occasion are simply to protect this city and its orbital network. Rest assured that much like your country, we have no intention of getting too deeply involved in Basel's affairs. There is some merit to that argument, but it also leaves out a number of key facts. You are to see that shareholders' Mira is used to generate a profit, and yet you covered up a huge potential problem for over a month. We confirmed last night that it wasn't just Almada's money being used for ill. Elsheim's investments were also misappropriated. 
And if these are the result of you turning a blind eye to Professor Callahan's behavior all this time... You, you keep your mouth shut! Just who do you think you are? Who gave you the right to speak? I don't care if you are student council president at Aramis! This is none of your... I am here as a special advisor for Liberals ZCF. I also serve as a negotiator representing the Epstein Foundation. In other words, I'm here to speak up against anything that threatens their interests, which this has. Now do I have the right to speak? Will you grow a damn spine? The, the danger here isn't over. Anyone can see that. And you still intend to do nothing after what happened to Callahan? Professor Hamilton left you in charge of Vern, of Basel. Don't you feel any shame? <coughs> I, I. In any event, we now have half a day before the cogs start turning again. Even if we do nothing, the Calvardian government will see to it that matters are resolved. But knowing how egregiously my country's funds have been misused, I refuse to stand by and do nothing. So, our cried solutions. Might I enlist your services for the remainder of the day? Of course, you can approach the task in whatever way best suits you, just as you did in Tharbad and have done many times before. My only true wish is that you put a stop to all modest plans before they can bear fruit. Does this sound doable? We'll be well compensated for this, I trust? It's been some time, Ferida. <sighs> I hear you've been taking good care of my sister, Arkwright Solutions. As for you, Van, it's been two years, I believe? I understand you've greatly improved your use of the stun caliber and your martial arts. Reset mentioned as much. As your former instructor, that fills me with great pride. <laughs> In that, we are agreed. Still, while we might be providing our services and your weapon, I believe the contract between us to be an equal one. I hope that we can continue our fine partnership, Mr. Arkwright. Information on our concierge is classified, I'm afraid. However, if an approximate time frame will suffice, I suppose I can oblige. About a year ago. Still, I know she's in good hands with Associate Professor Archette. I also happen to bring some compatible parts that she can use. Though I regret that Ms. Twinings will not be able to provide you with any more of her services for the time being. <laughs> well, I apologize for meddling in your affairs then. With that said, we must take our leave. We've negotiations with the Republican Army to attend to. As I mentioned during the conference, 
We've no intention of interfering in this crisis any more than is necessary. Fascinated though I am by what a genius can achieve through an obsession that knows no bounds. Cousin, wait! There are a number of matters Abby and I disagree on. Whether you are suited to being a warrior is very much one of them. <laughs> Still, I can only assume it was the guidance of the flames and Arusha that led you here. Battle is almost upon us, and I will be watching to see how you fare through it. <sighs> Fairy. As much as I'd love to write him off as an arrogant asshole, I can't get enough of a read on him. Just how tough is he? I'd say he's one of the strongest Jaegers who ever lived. Hello there. I hope everything went well. Thanks. Sounds like you pulled an all-nighter, huh? Looks like Zeros is up and running again. <laughs> mm-hmm. Fortunately for us, the damage for him wasn't so bad. I just wish I could say the same about Reset. Putting her back to the way she was is going to take a while. <sighs> Please, don't be so downhearted. The first-rate care you've been giving me has stabilized my vitals a considerable amount. <sighs> I'm relieved to hear that. Have you spoken to Mr. Thorndike? Did before coming here, yeah. He's as much of a questionable character as I was expecting. Their chief of security is the same old standoffish grump, too. You'd think it'd kill him to put on a smile. <laughs> That's just how they are, I'm afraid. <sighs> it's fine, you know. You don't need to force yourself to speak. Um, for what it's worth, her life isn't in any danger here. The medicine you helped me with yesterday seems to have been working wonders. She's right. It has really made this easier for me. Good to hear. We sure didn't think it'd end up being used on you when we took that job on. The artificial limbs that Mr. Thorndike brought with him are compatible with her too. That's not to say you shouldn't take it easy. Anything that involves the nervous system is a heavy burden on the body. The best thing you can do for yourself right now is get lots and lots of rest. I will. Thank you. Though... 
I truly am sorry for not being able to support you all when you need it most. Don't sweat it. We can take things from here. You just kick back and relax. Next time you wake up, you can bet we'll have good news to share. And a hell of a big bonus, too. <laughs> I'll have to look forward to that then, won't I? Follow your hearts and act as you always do. And everything will be fine. S sorry, but I'd like to ask you something. Why? Why did you risk your life to save mine? No one should have to put themselves through something like this over someone like me. <laughs> it was because you were just so dazzlingly radiant in that moment, I suppose. What? You have so many people who care about you, and you care about them just as much in return. To someone who's lost her bonds, memories, and even body, the sight was almost blinding. I'm a little jealous of all you have, if I'm to tell the truth. So please, treat yourself like an irreplaceable treasure, not just for you, but for those who love you too. Wait! Please. If it's not too much to ask, could I keep helping you? I want to stop Professor Callahan and the devils who've done this to him by my own hand. No matter what it takes. Oh, Katra. Sorry, but no can do. I suppose that's the right decision after I landed Reset in a hospital bed. I wasn't able to use Fio and Zeros at even half of their potential, either. If all I'm gonna be is a burden to the team? That ain't what I'm saying. You're no burden. We're gonna need you and your engineering know-how here for sure. But we're also not a charity. We only do favors for people if the client and price are a good fit. You heard what Reset said, right? If you did, then you should know what you gotta do. And where you went wrong. Huh? <laughs> You're right. I should never have done something that would upset the people who care about me. And I never will again. I just want to stop the chaos unfolding in Basel and the misuse of technology that created it. And if I'm going to do that, it's not the help of the police or guild I need. It's you. As compensation, I can offer you my skills and expertise on technology. I can also give you my word that I'll help Essie put Reset back to the way she was as fast as possible. Is that enough to make me a good fit for you? It sure is. We'd be happy to take that 4SPG on. We'll be counting on you now. 
Couldn't ask for better than a student of Professor Hamilton's. Thank you. I won't let you down. Promise me you'll take good care of him, okay? I'll be working around the clock, too. Promise. Thank you so much. Time to get down to business. This might be fundamentally different to what happened in Crossbell, but I still think that is our closest reference point. The Orbal Network and Septium Veins were used in the development of highly advanced technology then as well. Basel City also has both, making it the perfect environment to finish what they started. <laughs> 